Hey everybody, this is Stacy with SF Johnson Consulting and Construction Services. And in this video, I'm going to go over our Spring Hill Suites concrete plan and just go over a little information about if you are a concrete contractor and you are, you know, looking to see what the most efficient way to produce your takeoff. You know, I have some tips for you at all times, but make sure you too always take a class. We have new classes weekly, uh, workshops weekly, basic classes weekly, but full estimating classes every month. Okay, and so, and this one I already completed uh, the asphalt takeoff, thinking <laughs> I had the recording up and I didn't. So this time, and I'll show you what I did in the last video you didn't see, was that one step process I start here and just click 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 all the way around until I got my 50,000 square feet oh no in total we have 81,000 square feet of concrete okay so now I'm gonna do the same thing with our walkways and so when you do a takeoff especially for something like this where eventually everything's gonna fill in and going to cover up stuff but I always recommend especially with concrete asphalt I always will tackle the uh, I will also always tackle the easy stuff first which in this case we have tons of gutters so these lines right here is representative I've been doing this so long representative of gutters here on this sheet they don't show you the gutter symbol, but like I said, if you've done this for any amount of time, you know that's it. So a gutter can be built in different ways. Is it just a curb and a gutter? Is it just a gutter? Is it just a curb? Is it? So my question would be at some points, these curbs and gutters may be different. And so what I did, look through the set of plans, and yes, they have a site plan basically all the keynotes telling us what everything is and so I went here and looked and it looks like keynote 18 tells us all about the gutters or at least it should so we look at keynote 18 concrete curve okay and it tells me to CC as in civil set page 8 so we're gonna go back up Okay, so looking around, looking around, here are the curves, where, where we have a curb and a gutter, uh, just a curb, curb with the French drain, and so we have to either talk to the GC, talk to the sub, get a more hands-on explanation because we have so many different ones and none of them are marked out on the plan and so that kind of concerns me so I would like to know you know which kind of curb are we talking about uh, the mountable curb probably okay ones that are connected to pavement you know so that that's really my only concern is that when you're doing all of these curves and gutters that you have on this plan and again, all of these, these lines that you see, pretty much the perimeter, the whole thing, which ones are 8 inch, which ones are 6 inch, which is just a gutter, which is a curving gutter, which are the mountable ones. So that's my own concern. So concrete contractor, yes. You're going to get this big, and this is for our Spring Hill Suites from the ground up. So yeah, you're going to get all of the representations for the different types and then you just measure it out and then of course you're going to look at the details that's going to give you or should give you something in here to tell you about the bedding and and everything you need for that and you know all the details and there are a lot of details for this signs the striping okay say retaining curb if necessary so curb ramp 
1907. Okay, so you got to be mindful of all of this stuff when you're doing the review, but basically pretty easy. So let's do a quick takeoff of, so what's this symbol? Let's do that. And over time, you'll be able to do it that fast too. So that's the walkways. So of course, this is the building. So this symbol is the building pad. And the building pad is going to be in our foundation, on our foundation plan. So we don't need to measure that out because when we uh, work working on the civil set this week, but when we do the foundation, we'll be able to measure out the area, uh, form work, and then be able to determine all of the rebar totals. Okay, so uh, let's do a little quick, show you my skills with Plan Swift. And what is this, walkways? And so, after you have done something for so long, you pretty much, let's see, which way do I want to go? Let's go this way. And so I'm just going to follow along the lines. Sometimes you gotta get close to get right on the point. And here I'm gonna break it off. What are, what are we doing? We're doing the sidewalk takeoff. And trying to do it very quick. And see if you use Plan Swift and you click every corner, it'll also do your length. So you basically could measure your form work. But I always do everything separately. All right, we almost there. And then all of this is sidewalk too. Just want to do the straight. But you see, depending on the tool you have, the tools make all the difference in the world. And if you are a 
small company, you got to be able to knock these out, right? Uh, the more you bid, the more you win, period, 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 period. So your job is to get these estimates out to the GCs all over the place. And once we help you create a template, or you create your own, all you have to do really is to take all, you'll have all your, all your numbers. Okay, let's finish this. And this is something right here going on, but we'll do that at other time. something else. I just want to know how much you sign. go all around here and we'll do the other one. No, let's go back there. Oh, let's go back there. in a circle is annoying. I, I understand. <laughs> uh, let's go back. Let's cut it off right here. Can't go over too far because it'll cut itself off. Somebody made me laugh while I'm trying to be serious. We're going to cut this painful exercise. Oh, let's finish that. No, we can finish that. See, we're going to fill that in right there. But all of this is that. We're going to stop it. We're going to stop it right here at this where I started it. And just to show you, all right, let's stop it right there and go back up to here. All right. So these, these thingies, those are those uh, bubbles, the uh, ADA bubbles. 
So we'll have to measure those separately because that's a separate thing. And we can continue. So, so far we have walkways of uh, 7,800, 7,842. So we'd have to finish all of that. You know, it'd be a nice, nice project. But, you know, that's how you do that. But what I was telling my students, in this case, we, we want to start by measuring all of those gutters first. Because if we start to fill in everything, we fill in everything, we fill in, fill in everything first, you're not going to be able to see the gutters and you'll make a mistake. So that's simple. That's common sense. Fill in the stuff and work your way out. Okay, so if any questions, make sure you email me education at sfjohnsonconsulting.com. We have new classes every month. Estimated classes are 10 weeks where we meet 10 weeks. The first three are learning the takeoff, the pricing, the formatting. And then the other seven is where we work on increasingly harder estimates to where you can produce some beautiful work like I do and make your money. Okay, and look professional doing it. No lump sums. The only lump sum you'll give is on your letterhead that encompasses everything that we've created together. Okay, so any questions, make sure you contact me. This is Stacy with SF Johnson Consulting. Love what I do. Been doing it for 15 years and I'm going to continue. So, see you soon.